I've been coming here for, well, basically since the merge. Uh, Janet and I were a me members of the church that merged with the original New Hope. And uh, we've been attending here ever since. Since I've been attending here, um, I have grown deeper in the faith. I read my Bible more. I study more. I connect with people better. I'm kind of, by nature, kind of standoffish. But I find that, that more and more I'm a little bit more outgoing and happy to see people and engage with them. I realized that some of the issues that I was having weren't just unique to me, that these were the same things that other people dealt with. And uh, you don't feel like you're alone. I really am impressed with uh, the number of ministries that the church is involved in. And I, I think that uh, the more uh, we, we try to be involved in these ministries, the better we'll be. And uh, the church is involved in ministries that probably a lot of people in the church don't even know that we, we support. It's an encouragement when you see someone else doing something, it encourages you to do something. And we all don't have to do everything, we just have to do uh, what we can, and, and that'll be enough. There's something here for everybody, and we shouldn't make pride a way of life, but we can be proud of what New Hope does in this community and in communities around the world. There's something different at New Hope, and there's a feeling of comfort and belonging, and I've heard it, I don't know how many times from people that will say that it, they came because when they came here, they, they felt good, people were friendly, and they felt like they belonged here. And uh, I, think that's, I think that's important. I think it's one of the biggest characteristics. Uh, but if you go on a deeper level, I think that there's a commitment at New Hope to stay um, grounded in, in Bible teaching and encouraging people.